to another What's New video for WorkNC 2019 R1. In this video, we will show you how to limit the Z range of the Contour Remachine toolpath. In this work zone, we have a Contour Remachine toolpath already calculated. This toolpath is hitting all levels of the part stack. It is now possible to limit the toolpath to a single range or multiple ranges. Let's create a new toolpath. To be able to set the ranges, we must know the Z values for those ranges. Using the measuring tool, we can get approximate Z heights. Open the Z-Step menu and select Variable. Click Edit to enter the Z-Step levels. Enter the high-low value for each range you want to machine. When using multiple ranges, the Z-Levels need to be entered with highest Z-Values first, down to the lowest Z-Values. Please note, a value must be entered for the step-down field. However, this value is ignored. The step over value in the toolpath parameter will be used. Toolpath 2 is now limited to the ranges that we entered. Thank you for watching this What's New video for WorkNC 2019 R1.